Hey guys, how are you? Today we have a random spring Amazon order. I love like these little random like hauls because I can just like throw a bunch of stuff that I order in one. So it's more so, um, this is what I got going on. It's not necessarily styled, but if you guys want to see any of these pieces styled, you can go ahead and follow me on Instagram because that's where you'll see all these pieces like really come to life. But right now we're just having fun, trying some things on, talking about the quality, talking about the fit. And yeah, let me put some earrings in because I feel a little naked. So as you guys know, I'm obsessed with these like little sleeper dresses, I call them. It's like that ribbed knit material. Very comfortable, very cozy. Um, it doesn't have like any shaper in it. It's just like one of those dresses you throw on. And I absolutely am obsessed with this blue. I love how the lights from my windows are like hitting this dress right now. It looks so cute. But anyhow, this is a really um, simple dress that I throw on and I have in like 68 different colors. So I'm gonna link this down below as well. But without further ado, let's open up some boxes. Alrighty, first up we have this little milkmaid dress. I feel like these could be very hit or miss. For me, I absolutely love this style dress. I feel like it's so cute and dainty and I feel like it's girly, but I love like, look at those straps right here, how they have the scallop lace. I think that's such a cutie feature. And then it has the cups, just so you know, the cups don't have any support. I'm actually wearing nipple covers underneath. It has this little fake tie, and I call it a fake tie because it's not like the tie goes through the dress. It's literally just here and you just tie it. And then we have the corset style in the middle to create that hourglass figure. And then when you do this little V shape right here, again, it draws the body to go inward. And then it has like this puff, so it gives you that hourglass, that little in and then out. But I think she's so pretty, 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 pretty. And then this is also line too which is good because when you have white dresses, it's a little scary. Like, are they gonna see anything underneath? Like, what do I wear? But I feel like she gives good coverage. I like how the hem on this is that scalloped lace, just like the sleeve. Now the back is that like elastic bag to keep everything like tight and flush to your body. I'm gonna small. And I feel like she has some really good stretch. I feel like this is one of those really pretty dresses for the summer. Like imagine like a picnic, you got your hat on, you got your blanket laid out, you got some fruit, a little champagne. Like baby, this is that's the vibe. I'm not usually a fan of showing you guys things that like don't work out for me. It's usually like, let me just show you the pretty good stuff. But you know what? With this new editing, with this new thing that I'm doing and being just super raw with you guys, I'm gonna show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. This dress was a dress that I absolutely wanted. I have like a tropical vacation coming up and I was like, oh, I need something like super cute, super flowy. And when you see the details on the back, you'll see like why I fell in love. But like, look at this. Look how cute. Then it has like the little braid going down the front. But the issue is it looks so wide and moo moo ish. I lose my shape. So I'm unable to belt it. And you guys will see like when I turn around in the back, it is all back like to the point where you could see some some things back there. But what I loved about it and then I'll move my hair so you guys can see is how pretty that back was like what? The details on that back just was so like insanely gorgeous that I was like, oh, I need this in my life. The material, it's like that crinkly cut, you know, it's not bad. It's very sheer though, it's very lightweight. It's not giving coverage at all. Like, and I can't see what kind of bathing suit to wear underneath of this. I could say maybe like a tube top style, but like something's off. I don't know if I'm too short for this dress, something's off. Oof, okay, so something a little bit more casual, something a little bit more toned down. I absolutely love a good set, y'all. I don't know about y'all, but like when I can find me a set that's good quality, good material, sign me up, right? So this set just gives me so much joy because it's marrying comfort, it's, mar it's marrying quality with, you know, absolutely just being cute. I totally can see myself like styling this up a little bit and making it a little bit more dressy than this, but I also can see myself just like picking up Ava, throwing on some flats and like, baby, I'm out the door. So I love the versatility it gives. Functional pockets, we love those. Jawstring, it is a ribbed knit material. I'm gonna get closer so you guys can see that. 
kind of like a high neck, not necessarily crew. Then it has the ruching on the side, which always like is a vibe for me. And then it actually has some really good stretch. Like look how stretchy my homegirl is. Ah, love her. And then this pleat right down the front of the pant too good so guys just so you guys know i am 5'4 i feel like i said that i feel like i had it on the screen but just to reiterate i am 5'4 and so you guys can see where these pants stop um if i sit on my tippy toes what am i 5'8 now <laughs> i don't know 5'7 so just be mindful if you are a little bit taller than me um if this will work for your frame or not Alrighty, i switched out my whole outfit but i'm gonna start with just this top this top i'm in my corset era i don't know why like these made a comeback for me in my wardrobe because for a while I was off of them like I just wasn't a fan I was like eh, you know but like now I'm back and I really like her I wish I just ugh, maybe she came oh wait never mind <laughs> I, was like, I wish she came a little bit longer but I had this part tucked in <laughs> okay so she does come long enough maybe a smidge longer in the back maybe just a smidge. i'm gonna turn around in the, in the back in a second but you know what really drew me to her was this detailing right here i love like this these little folds i think that's really cute this also too when you have these lines it gives you that illusion like your waist is going in and we like those things okay the straps are adjustable the back is that elastic vibe um that you guys saw in that white dress so some for, for some people that looks ill for me i don't mind but yeah now we're gonna back up and show you these jeans <gasps> oh, i've been on a hunt for some really good quality jeans and i feel like last year was my mission to find some good jeans but then I got really let down by Amazon and then I found these um, light blue jeans from the drop on Amazon that now are like my staple and I wear them literally twice a week on the gram and I know you guys are tired of seeing me in them so I was like let me get another pair of jeans and stat. So these jeans are so so pretty like <laughs> wide leg which I've been looking for a really good pair of wide leg. They have like a little bit of lighter wash right here which I'm not mad at. Um, this little pleat right here, really good details, pockets, functional. On the side, they have like this little extra strip right here, but then, then the two seams, which is really cool. Then, um, I don't know, they give me vintage era, vintage vibes, but at the same time, like, we can do a lot with these. There's no stretch, none. And I'm a fan of like jeans that have stretch, but I realize the ones that don't have stretch last a little bit longer in my wardrobe. Maybe it's just me. But they last a little bit longer the qual quality wise and then in the back they have like this really fun detail this little buckle these pockets that, that those aren't pockets that's fake <laughs> fake news but it's just like a cute little details in the back so nothing is missed but like what do we think about these right wait till you guys see like my vision on styling them and putting them together i, I don't know i feel as though like this is this is gonna make for some really elevated looks bring some elevated looks together all right moving along Ooh. <gasps> florals for spring groundbreaking okay y'all let me step back oof oof i am gagging why because i am not normally a prince person i don't do a lot of prints i am like solid 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 but i feel like when i do bust out like my prints and i do bust out like something different than the norm it's it's a pleasant surprise on like my instagram feed so and then i gotta remember like too i want to show you guys everything i don't want to just be limited to my little neutral box right so what do we think about her I, like what do you really think is skirt sets your vibe like is skirt says something we did back in the day and we're not doing it anymore I personally think that we should be busting these babies out. First and foremost, this material is like that sheer line material, but then it has the lining underneath, which I love being covered in cute and not, in, not having to worry about like, oh my God, is this showing and da 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 But look at the colors. If that doesn't scream spring, I don't know what does. And I am 5'4 again, so look how long this comes down on me. 
Again, the back is full coverage. Like it goes all the way up the back, all the way down. There's no like closures. There's no zippers. There's no buttons. You just plop this baby on. The stretch is literally insane. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys. So I needed me a new black purse. I felt like I was giving that Hermes inspired purse a little bit too much airplay and I needed to like switch it up. So I'm going to face it this way just so you guys can see like that little flat detail. Do you see how uneven she is? I feel like that's what makes it cute, right? I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but like that detail alone just really sold me when I saw this purse. So it, you can wear it as a clutch, but as you guys can see, the buckles are here. The strap is inside of the purse. I was trying to open it up, but let's see. Let's do this together. You're like, oh my God, Kira, stop. The inside has some really good space. Okay, like I'm feeling like I can fit a lot in here. Yeah, like I can fit my phone, my keys, my wallet, my everything. This is a really good staple purse to go out with. Okay, so one of my girls on Instagram actually sent me this dress. She was like, oh my God, Kira, you gotta have it. And I just don't know if I can fill out this dress maybe the way she envisioned or I don't know, but something is off to me with this dress. First of all, I don't like how my stomach looks. I don't know if it's because of this that time or what, but it's, I'm not feeling it. Um, and then also too, the material itself is a little slinky, so it makes the dress itself rise up when I walk, which causes more material to go here, which makes it look weird to me. But it does have some really cute elements, like the fringe at the bottom I think is really fun and playful. Um, and you have like this really cute neckline that this tie clips around in the back and then it has like this, you know, so I do see good qualities about this dress that I'm like, oh, the details, the hit, the bop, 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 bop. But like, I don't think on me, this looks good. Hi, we have another dress. I am like the dress girl. I love me a good maxi dress, but look at this. I think she's very sweet, very dainty, very girly. I like all of the above. I'm gonna get a little bit closer. Love the puff sleeves on that. Very cute. Then we have this little tie feature in the front with a little bit of elastic down here, I guess to keep it nice and snug. I am not a really good bow tire, so it's, this is giving nasty, but I swear to you guys, it's very cute. Look at this nice wide full skirt with the ruffle hem. It's just giving very sweet. I would say, hey, we could wear this to church, but I do not want to get chewed out in the comments and be like, no, you cannot wear that to church. So I'm just going to play it safe with wear this wherever you feel, but she's a cute dress. She's covered. She's showing just enough. She's, um, you know. So sorry, guys, if you hear my dog snoring in the background, I am so sorry. She tends to do that while I'm working and it's rude, it's rude, but you know, what can I do? Anywho, let's get into this set. <laughs> <gasps> guys y'all know I love just like looking good all the time I don't care if I'm chilling in my house I don't care if I'm picking up my daughter from school like I just want to look put together I think that's the best way to describe the clothing era that I'm in like I just want to be polished 24 7 so when I see these sets come in um it's better than just like wearing like a t-shirt and some leggings throwing on that you know like it's actually thought out a little bit because you can always like dress these up put on like a really cute pair of flats or some sneakers and put it at a necklace and like that'll really take this look from casual to really doing something so and then also too burgundy is not a color i gravitate towards often like this burgundy wine i could probably tell you i have like maybe three pieces in my closet that are this color. So I wanted to switch it up. All right, guys, and the last of this random Amazon order, and then we were all set, are two things that I have on. Number one, it's this long line white button up. So what I love about this button up, okay, is that she can be worn casually or dressed up. It's just one of those things I feel as though we need in the wardrobe to just like have. Like I can totally see this with like some wide leg jeans and some cute little, you know, slip on, pointed toe heels and like a little bag and calling it a day I can totally see her just with so much you know I think she's very very versatile like even as a beach cover-up you know so if not dressed up you could definitely 
use her to just throw on knock the chill off it's giving movie date okay it's giving movie date but yeah let's get into these shorts i love a good colorful short I actually don't own any right now that fit to my liking. So I'm super glad that I went ahead and got these. I like this thick waistband. I love these pleats. I love the functional pockets. I love that the buttons are the same color. I don't know if you guys have realized that about me. Like I tend to gravitate towards same buttons as the same material. I just like, I just like that look a little bit more to me. That feels a little bit more luxe, but they don't come down too long. They're not too short. I feel like they're good. They are like good. But anywho, that is my haul. I hope you guys loved it. Yay! I love like just popping on here and hanging out with you guys. So if that's your jam, please make sure you subscribe, y'all. I was looking at my analytics and like 60% of the people that watch my videos aren't subscribed. It makes me sad. I want to give you guys more and more and more. So please hit that subscribe button so you guys can be in the loop, be in the know, and get those notifications. Also sign up to my email list below so I can send you guys an email once a week. And also too, you'll get this month's lookbook uh, when you do. So I'll see you guys soon. My schedule is every Wednesday at 7 p.m. and every Saturday at 10 a.m. So I'll see you guys soon, bye.